Oh, is Rose she gonna is... bite me? No, she's not gonna bite. Just oh. hold her firm. So right now we're getting ready for harvest. Let's go meet our gardener. So here's our gardener, Pat McKenna here. Hey. Hello. And Pat is really responsible for tending to our garden, if you will, but not only do you tend to it, you really created our garden. So what inspired you guys to start a garden here? Well, we made it big, a lot bigger is what we did. And uh, the chef wanted to have that uh, sort of farm to table thing. And it's worked out well. People come down to the visit the garden. So it's not just food coming into the restaurant, but also it's a nice place for people to wander around on the weekend and whatnot. Awesome, can you show me around? Yeah, okay. I want to show you the bees here. Now, not so much important with the vineyards because uh, grapevines are self-pollinating, but with a lot of other plants, they have to have some sort of pollinator come in there and spread that pollen. So this is uh, the newest addition to the garden. Um, I built the pen back in uh, January. We've got six chickens and uh, getting eggs now. Wonderful. And what are the chickens used for? Just for the eggs. You know, I can throw them scraps from when I'm cleaning lettuce and whatnot, and then rake out their pan, and then all the compost from a lot of the compost from the garden here and from the chicken pen, then it's going to go up to uh, our compost piles near Viticulture. Are you going to bite me? No, she's not going to bite. Just hold her firm, nice and firm. Rosie. So Pat, I know you planted some things in this garden for our other restaurant, where mm -hmm. Wacomaco up at Virginia Dare. Can you tell me sort of what you planted here? I'll show, you, I'll show you the three sisters over here. So this is an example of what East Coast Native Americans would plant. Corn, beans, and some sort of squash here. We've got pumpkins. So what kind of menu items might Chef use this for? So, well, the corn, he might roast it. The pumpkins uh, will work both up there at Wero, but also here in the rustic because a lot of times they'll take the winter squashes and make uh, like a winter squash gnocchis or uh, winter squash uh, stuffed raviolis. We usually get asked which came first, the gardener or the chef? What do you think? It's the chef. He's the boss. <laughs> <laughs> Tune in tomorrow to see Francis's movie memorabilia.